Inside the shadow of Geneva, under the world's surface, lies a marvel of human creative mind and an expected harbinger of decimation, the Beast Hadron Collider LHC. This machine is an uncommon contraption for experts, empowering them to zero in on subatomic particles and uncover the baffling god atom, the Higgs boson. Famous physicist Brian Cox has made a chilling explanation that has blended sentiments among researchers, permitting them to test the principal building blocks of matter and dissect the genuine surface of spacetime. Yet, the colossal energies engaged in these impacts also present critical hazards, both known and obscure. One of the most pressing concerns surrounding the operation of the monstrous Hadron Collider is the possible production of many black holes or other exceptional peculiarities that could have unexpected consequences. While theoretical models propose that any such black holes would be transient and imply no liability to Earth or its occupants, the chance to accidentally make power beyond our reach remains troublesome. Furthermore, the sheer scale and intricacy of the tests led at the collider require thorough security conventions and oversight to mitigate potential perils. The global community of specialists and researchers associated with the collider's operation is very much aware of the need to focus on security and ensure that all tests are led with extreme attention to detail and responsibility. The Huge Hadron Collider, with its ability to stun and challenge how we might interpret the texture of reality, isn't simply a wonder of modern engineering but also a focal center of contemporary particle physics and cosmology. Its primary goal is to test the crucial particles that make up the universe, and it has significant implications for how we comprehend existence. The LHC enables researchers to replicate circumstances only minutes after the Big Bang, giving a striking opportunity to review the Higgs boson and other key particles. The Higgs boson, frequently referred to as the God particle, was hypothesized in 1964 by Peter Higgs and others as a fundamental piece of the standard model of particle physics. This model describes the key forces and particles that make up the universe. The discovery of the Higgs boson at the LHC in 2012 confirmed the presence of the Higgs field, an imperceptible field that gives mass to different particles. This discovery was a huge achievement, validating decades of theoretical work and evolving understanding of the universe's secret construction. However, like all major scientific endeavors, the journey for knowledge at the LHC isn't without its expected dangers and moral dilemmas. The energies involved in particle collisions at the LHC are gigantic, and the possibility of creating new kinds of matter or triggering unforeseen reactions can't be fully excluded. Some researchers have speculated about scenarios in which high-energy collisions could create tiny black holes or other strange particles, raising concerns about the potential consequences of such events. While most specialists believe these risks to be incredibly remote, the very nature of scientific inquiry involves venturing into the unknown. Brian Cox's admission, highlighting the potential for mimicking a small big bang within the LHC, underscores the immense significance and possible risks of this investigation. The Large Hadron Collider represents the zenith of modern scientific endeavors. However, its remarkable capabilities also spark key conversations about the limits and responsibilities of scientific exploration. The Collider, through its design and operation, aims to answer key questions about the universe, yet it operates at the limits of human knowledge and technological capability. This convergence raises significant issues about the nature of scientific risk and the ethical implications of such advanced research. One of the most exciting aspects of the LHC is its capacity to replicate conditions only minutes after the Big Bang, offering a fascinating look into the early universe. This reproduction allows researchers to study particles that existed in the early stages of the universe and investigate phenomena that would otherwise be difficult to access. By recreating these extreme conditions, Scientists can test theoretical predictions and refine models of particle physics. For example, research at the LHC can potentially examine the properties of speculative dark matter particles, which are believed to make up a significant portion of the universe's mass but remain elusive to direct detection. The mission to understand dark matter is driven by its profound implications for our understanding of the universe. Currently, dark matter is inferred from its gravitational effects on visible matter but direct detection remains challenging. The LHC's experiments aim to address this challenge by attempting to produce dark matter particles in the lab. If successful, this could revolutionize how we interpret the universe and possibly lead to new discoveries and insights. 
Such breakthroughs highlight the LHC's role as a scientific instrument and a catalyst for pivotal discoveries that could reshape our perspective. Another thrilling area of exploration includes the strong force, one of the four key forces in nature. The strong force binds protons and neutrons inside the atomic nucleus, and understanding its behavior at high energies can provide insights into the fundamental structure of matter. The LHC's ability to test strong force interactions on an extreme scale enables researchers to explore the dynamics between quarks and gluons, the fundamental particles that mediate these powerful forces. These investigations could lead to a deeper understanding of nuclear physics and the forces governing the behavior of atomic nuclei. The technological advancements driven by the LHC extend beyond particle physics. The collider's complex systems for detecting and analyzing particle collisions have spurred innovations in computing, data analysis, and sensor technology. For instance, the development of the World Wide Web was initially conceived as a way for scientists to share data from particle physics experiments at CERN. Today, this technology has transformed global communication and information sharing. The advances in computing and data management required for the LHC have had a broad impact across various fields demonstrating how major scientific research can drive technological progress. However, the operation of such a powerful instrument also requires strict safety measures and ethical considerations. The potential for unexpected results, such as the creation of new or strange particles, necessitates a careful assessment of risks. While theoretical models suggest that the likelihood of catastrophic events is very low, the possibility can't be completely ruled out. This uncertainty requires researchers to approach their work with caution and transparency, ensuring that safety protocols are effective and that the public is informed about potential risks and the measures taken to mitigate them. Public engagement and understanding are critical components of scientific research, especially for projects with the potential to impact society at large. The LHC has generated significant interest and discussion highlighting the importance of communicating complex scientific plans to a broader audience. Effective science communication demystifies research and fosters informed public discourse about the implications and risks associated with advanced scientific investigations. By maintaining an open dialogue with the public, scientists can address concerns, dispel misconceptions, and build trust in the scientific process. As we move forward, the continued operation of the LHC and the potential for new discoveries raise important questions about the future of scientific exploration. As we move forward, the continued operation of the LHC and the potential for new discoveries raise important questions about the future of scientific exploration. How far should we push the boundaries of our knowledge, particularly when the consequences of our experiments are uncertain? The ethical considerations of high-energy physics research go beyond the scientific community touching on broader societal concerns about safety, transparency, and the responsible use of technology. The LHC's achievements thus far have not only advanced our understanding of the universe but have also demonstrated the power of international collaboration. The facility brings together researchers from all over the world, pooling their expertise and resources to tackle some of the most profound questions about existence. This spirit of cooperation underscores the importance of shared responsibility in addressing the potential risks and rewards of cutting-edge science. As humanity seeks to unlock the secrets of the cosmos, we must balance our thirst for knowledge with a deep sense of caution and accountability. The LHC serves as a reminder of the incredible potential of scientific inquiry, but it also highlights the need for rigorous oversight and ethical reflection. In the quest to explore the unknown, we must remain mindful of the broader implications of our work, ensuring that the pursuit of discovery is guided by a commitment to the well-being of humanity and the preservation of our planet. The future of the LHC and similar endeavors lies in our collective ability to navigate these challenges thoughtfully and responsibly. By fostering dialogue, advancing safety protocols, and embracing a shared vision for progress, we can continue to push the boundaries of human knowledge while safeguarding the world we inhabit. The journey of discovery is not without risks, but it is through careful consideration and collaboration that we can ensure it remains a force for good. Logical requests regarding the collider's capacity to test novel areas of molecular physics might prompt new inquiries and challenges, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge even further. The quest for these frontiers will require ongoing collaboration between scientists, 
specialists, and policymakers to ensure that research is conducted responsibly and that the benefits of scientific advancements are maximized while minimizing potential risks. The LHC remains a testament to human ingenuity and the determined pursuit of knowledge. It embodies a fusion of cutting-edge technology, theoretical physics, and global cooperation, representing the collective effort to understand the universe's most profound mysteries. As we advance in our exploration of the fundamental forces and particles that shape our existence, it is crucial to remain mindful of the ethical implications and potential consequences of our discoveries. The Large Hadron Collider stands at the forefront of scientific inquiry, offering significant insights into the nature of the universe. Its experiments have the potential to uncover new realms of knowledge, drive technological development, and reshape our understanding of existence. Yet, with its extraordinary capabilities come great responsibilities. The pursuit of knowledge must be balanced with a commitment to safety, transparency, and public engagement, ensuring that the quest for understanding aligns with the broader ethical considerations of our time. Throughout the scientific community, there is a conviction that something fundamental has been discovered at CERN, with implications beyond our current understanding. Before delving into the implications of Brian Cox's statement, it is essential to understand how the Large Hadron Collider, LHC, functions. Operated by CERN, the LHC is a 17-mile ring of superconducting magnets and the world's most powerful particle accelerator. It stands as a pinnacle of human achievement, capable of recreating the conditions of the universe's birth. This monumental machine allows us to unlock the mysteries of the universe, revealing something truly groundbreaking and potentially world-changing. CERN, established in 1954, is one of the world's most esteemed research institutions, comprising 23 member states and a vast network of scientists. The LHC is CERN's flagship project, but it is only one part of a larger network of accelerators and detectors that explore the subatomic world. The LHC accelerates protons to nearly the speed of light, replicating the energy of the universe at the moment of the Big Bang. The resulting collisions create temperatures millions of times hotter than the sun's core. An intricate array of magnets guides the protons on their journey, while advanced cooling systems maintain the magnets at temperatures colder than outer space. The LHC's design is an engineering marvel, operating deep underground and shielded from cosmic radiation. The entire ring is cooled to temperatures colder than the vacuum of space, essential for the superconducting magnets to function. Collisions occur at four points along the accelerator ring, each corresponding to one of the four major particle detectors, ATLAS, CMS, ALICE, and LHCB. These detectors capture the aftermath of collisions, allowing scientists to sift through the debris in search of the elusive Higgs boson, a particle key to understanding the universe's structure. The LHC is not only a scientific tool but also a testament to human imagination and ambition. It represents our quest for knowledge and our desire to understand the fundamental forces shaping our universe. However, as we push the boundaries of understanding, we must also consider the ethical and existential questions that arise. What are the risks of exploring the unknown? Could our quest for meaning unintentionally unleash forces beyond our control? Within CERN's hallowed halls, where the frontiers of human knowledge are continually expanding, a discovery has emerged that has unsettled even the most seasoned scientists. Brian Cox, a former researcher at CERN and a respected voice in particle physics, recently made a statement that has both intrigued and alarmed mainstream experts. The goal of CERN's Large Hadron Collider is to replicate a small version of the Big Bang, the event that birthed our universe. Cox also highlighted the potential implications of this goal, noting the LHC's ability to create new phenomena, including its capacity to reveal the Higgs boson and study dark matter, substances that make up a significant portion of the universe. The possibility of recreating a miniature Big Bang is not merely a theoretical concept. It is a genuine possibility within the LHC. The conditions inside the collider mirror those that existed at the universe's inception, allowing scientists to observe the birth of existence itself. However, with such power comes immense responsibility and potential risk. Consider the scenario. What if something goes wrong? In 1978, 
Russian physicist Anatoly Bugorsky suffered an accident at the Institute for High Energy Physics in Russia, where a malfunction caused his head to intersect with a proton beam, resulting in severe injuries. Despite this, Bugorsky survived and continued his work, highlighting the immense power and potential dangers of particle accelerators. The risks associated with a particle collider like the LHC are not to be underestimated. The potential for unexpected reactions and the manipulation of the very fabric of reality are real concerns voiced by some in the scientific community. One significant fear surrounding the LHC's experiments is the possibility of creating miniature black holes, regions of space-time with such intense gravitational pull that not even light can escape. If the LHC were to produce such a phenomenon, even on a small scale it could hypothetically consume the Earth from within. However, CERN scientists have assured the public that any black holes created would dissipate almost instantly. Understanding how the LHC could create a black hole involves the fundamental mechanics of particle accelerators. When protons collide at nearly the speed of light, the energy is so intense that it could warp the fabric of spacetime itself. This remarkable yet unsettling possibility has even drawn the attention of prominent physicists such as the late Stephen Hawking, who warned that the Higgs boson could become unstable at extremely high energy levels, potentially triggering a catastrophic vacuum decay, an event that could destroy the universe. Renowned cosmologist Sir Martin Rees has also expressed concerns about particle collider experiments, including those at CERN. In his book Our Final Century, he contemplates the potential risks of collider experiments, including the creation of vacuum instability. While these scenarios remain highly speculative, even a remote possibility warrants serious consideration. The stakes are extraordinarily high, and the margin for error is razor-thin.